Hey guys, what is going on? This is Travis. I'd like to welcome you back to the channel. Well guys, it is time for another cup of coffee and today we're going to take a look at the starter kit from Combio Roasters. Uh, Combio Roasters, this is kind of interesting. My mom actually saw this advertisement on Facebook and this little starter kit was only $1.99 to get you started. Now, unfortunately I don't have the link for that starter kit, but Combio does feature some really fair prices. When it comes to coffee, we're going to do a little unboxing and see what you get in the $2 starter kit and uh, we'll talk a little bit about the coffee uh, company themselves. Now, if you're not familiar with Combio Roasters, they're a relative newcomer to the coffee pod game. Uh, they do have some ties back to, former ties back to Keurig, as well as working for different nonprofits and, uh, and other businesses. So what's cool about Combio Roasters is they do give a percentage back of their sales to the growers, to the workers themselves, the farmers, and the communities that produce the coffee. They're doing work in several com uh, countries to uh, help those countries out and help those people become more self-sustaining. I think that's cool. It's cool when companies do something like that. They give a little bit back to where the uh, product comes from and uh, looks like they got a pretty good variety what I've seen online. So, let's as for different blends, uh, Combio that I've noticed online, they've got uh, Donut Blend, House Blend, French Rose, Sumatran, uh, Colombian, Hazelnut, Decaf, and then a variety pack. And then once you buy your first 30 pack, you can also get into an exclusive club that they have where they will send you certain limited releases and single origin blends and so on. So if you're somebody who's really into your coffee, it is cool that they offer that kind of an option. So let's go ahead and get this started. Let's open this up and see what they sent us in our little starter kit for today. The box just basically comes apart. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, I also need to mention, yes, they do have uh, biscottis, t-shirts, mugs, and stuff like that. Here's a double chocolate chip biscotti. Always good to have that. I'll definitely eat that with my uh, cup of coffee here. Let's back up a little bit. All right, you do get a cool little burlap bag, kind of reminiscent of uh, you know how the coffee beans show up into this country when they get here. And is that a sticker? It's a little tag. We've got 20% off. Prices on their coffee, I'm seeing about $14.70, depending on the, the variety that you get for a 30 count. And another cool thing about them is they do have free shipping. And I don't know if that's just going to be a limited time thing or if this is going to be something that, uh, uh, you know, they offer all the time. Either way, that's cool because sometimes on shipping, they really get you. So got a 20% coupon on there, which is really cool, too. Um, interesting thing is my mom just happened to tell the lady that I had a, a YouTube channel, one of the one of the co-founders of the company. And uh, while we did pay for this, she is looking forward to my review on this coffee. So we're going to see if it uh, lives up to the hype. I'm pretty excited. Let's just go ahead and put these in the box and see what they gave us here. Uh, another neat thing about it is the K-Cups are 100% recyclable, which is really cool. Uh, they are marked with the recycle tag on them and also on the bottom, polypropylene. They've got the code on there too, so you can recycle them. So we've got ourselves a French roast, dark roast. We've got a house blend medium roast, really cool. And we have got a Sumatran medium roast, excellent, excellent. And a, let's see, another Colombian medium roast. Uh, donut blend, which is always a good one in the mornings to start off with, you know, not too heavy, nothing too smoky. Uh, hazelnut light roast, and then also a decaf. Okay, so I'm not a big fan of decaf, and um, I understand people sometimes have to drink it, or they want to drink it, or maybe caffeine doesn't agree with them. So we will try this one at some point, it just won't be today, all right? Nothing wrong with that. Uh, I think we're probably going to go for the uh, the French roast because I have a lot of dark coffee experience. I can really, dark roast, I can really uh, compare this up against and see how it compares in terms of body and boldness and smokiness and flavor and so on. And uh, something that's really cool, I believe this is one of the co-CEOs of the company. She says, Travis, thank you for trying our coffee. We hope you like it. Cheers. And Hudson. So while I did pay for this, or while my mom actually paid for this, um, we're going to go ahead and give it a try and just uh, see how it is. All right, so we're brewing here. Let's just get a little whiff. Oh yeah, it does smell good. It smells really good. It doesn't smell like it's too burned. It's got a nice rich smell to it. It does make a nice little crema or foam that's a process of uh, some air molecules being released while it's brewing. Always a good sign. There we go. Okay, we're gonna let that sit for a minute. We'll do a little taste test and then we'll come right back. All right, let's go ahead and give this uh, French roast a little sip here and see how it is. Oh, that's good. That is very good. Yeah, it's got just the right kind of balance of that kind of that smokiness and that richness that you look for in your French roast coffee. Almost kind of like, a, like an espresso roast if you've ever had something like that before. Mm. Very light and actually kind of crisp, which is unusual. A lot of times with your, your French roasts, they tend to be kind of heavy and bold. But this has got a nice balance. I like this. It would be a good afternoon dark roast if you don't want something real heavy for the morning. I do like it. I do like it. So... 
this is a good sign. Um, as for caffeine content, I can't tell you if this stuff is supercharged with caffeine or not, but uh, we're gonna finish the cup, and then actually we're gonna be making a Raspberry Pi 3B video, so this is gonna fuel that next video that I'm gonna be filming. So, Cambio Coffee Company, which by the way, Cambio is Spanish for change, according to Anne, one of the co-founders of the company, and if I got that right, and uh, that's what the company's all about. So that's really cool that they do want to put a little bit back into the communities where they're getting their, their items from or just help out communities in general. So Cambio Coffee Company, from now I'm going to give you two thumbs up. This is a good cup of coffee. I'm going to finish it off, work on the rest of these blends this week. I might just order some more. Um, like I said, once you get an order of 30 out of the way, what I've seen before, you can get onto their exclusive membership club, which gets you into their, their single origin orders and their limited releases and stuff like that. And they also have a Christmas present that they send to customers, which is kind of cool around the holidays. So that's kind of neat too. So Cambio Coffee Company, thank you very much. Uh, this is great. Like I said, this was a little $2 deal that uh, you might just see pop up on Facebook. Make sure you check out uh, CambioCoffee.com or CambioCoffeeRoasters.com if I'm not mistaken. Um, otherwise, guys, that's it. I want to thank you for joining us today. A lot more videos coming the way on the channel. Uh, please make sure you like and subscribe. And guys, as always, I want you to have fun. I want you to be safe. And as you know, we will talk to you soon. Drink lots of coffee. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye.